There we go. Should be back up now. I almost feel like it's a universe. Um, yeah, man. Total Biscuit is like one of my all time favorite YouTubers. And just as a human being, he's actually he was one of my favorite people just on the planet, full stop. Just even when he said he was going off of treatments and stuff because they weren't working and he his kidneys were so bad he couldn't even go to a experimental treatment, I thought this dude has more determination than anybody else on earth. He'll still stick around for a couple more months and it was like a week maybe two when Total Biscuit was gone. I couldn't believe that either too. It was like Oh, he's in the hospital. He's dead. Fuck. I don't know how the heck his wife is surviving. She posted a picture of one of her dogs. Like, somebody's still waiting for somebody to come home. And it was just like, immediately I had to get up. Yeah, it was like yesterday. I had to get up off my computer and just go lay down by my dog. It's like, that's too fucking depressing. It's like, the dude was a fucking legend, man. We're all lucky that we even got to be alive in the same time as him. Yeah, man, dude, that, that, that's, like, still, like, it's been a couple days, and I still wake up, and every time I, uh, I walk around the house, I'll go, I just can't believe he's gone, because like I was saying, I don't know if the stream cut out, but, dude, I was looking forward to hearing him and Jesse Cox go back and forth on so many discussions, on, like, so many new games coming out, like Detroit Become Human and stuff, and maybe even God of War some more, and now it's just like, I, okay, I'm going to hear Jesse, but I'm, I need to hear the other half of that story. Like, them in the Co-Optional Podcast, for years, has been like, you know, the go-to. You got Jesse being a little bit too positive on everything, and TB maybe being a little bit too negative on everything, but usually quite level and serious. And now it's like, what is this? Is, is Total Biscuit's wife might take over, Gina, but I get the feeling she's not exactly wanting to do that. If she is, then, well... I hope the other guys and her can pull it off, but it's like, what's what's the co-optional podcast going to be all without him, man? 33 years old he was. 33 years old. Five years older than me. The dude's in the ground. Like, I remember seeing that, like, post of him dead, and it's like, before the night was out, I was thinking, like, that brilliant human being that I adored so much is laying in a freezer somewhere just decaying. Like, everything that made that man is gone. It's just a decaying husk now. That beautiful mind is literally rotting away. Literally rotting. This, it pisses me off too because it makes me think about society and when you have these huge military budgets and everything and throwing at war, this and that. And it's like, what if we spent at least half that on medical science, huh? Could we have saved his life? Obviously, his life probably could have been saved if he hadn't been so strong-headed and not gone to the doctor, which is a big thing he talked about, is go get yourself a colon checkup if you're having issues down there. If you got blood and whatnot, go get checked out. I got checked out because he was saying that. It turned out to be nothing for me, just like hemorrhoids or something. But I still got checked out because it was... Because he got hit with this shit because he thought oh it's nothing and i don't want doctors poking at my rumpus or nothing he waited till he was 29 to get checked out even though he was having issues for a few years and that's what got him in this shit and in the end that cost him his life so he was a big proponent of you got issues in your downstairs plumbing you get that shit checked out no matter how embarrassing it is get that shit checked out because you might end up being a great person like total biscuit you might end up being in the ground at 33 years old Go get yourself checked out if you got shit. Do as he says, not as he did. But yeah, that, that's... It's, it's fucking... Yeah. It's like, he was such a big part of gaming. Modern gaming. and Honestly, he was such a big part of like all this gaming stuff I would pay attention to and listen to. It was like, okay, Achievement Hunter, you know. They're head in the clouds they're not serious about nothing they don't pay attention to too many things it seems you know and obviously even if they do they don't talk about it because they want to keep everything fun and floaty okay yogs yeah sometimes do they can be a bit more grumpy and serious and stuff but you know still a bit floaty at times but total biscuit man the fucker was real the guy was legit and he wasn't like jim sterling where jim sterling is entertaining and usually very serious but the dude is a bit you know Bruh! 
that to a point of I'm sure it turns some people off. I love his shit, but I'm sure it turns some people off. Total Biscuit, even though he would get all aggro sometimes about shit. Anything he got aggro about, there was fucking good reason for him to be grumpy about. Fucking can't believe he's gone. So yeah, you know, here comes uh, Detroit Become Human. We'll hear Jesse Cox probably... Honestly, Jesse, I bet you, is going to be more negative on that than he would have been otherwise. I bet you money on that. Just because he... It's like, even if it's subconscious, he knows he's got to hold up that side a little bit more than he would otherwise. Either that or he's going to just throw himself into it like crazy. And be just, like, super positive because he's not going to have anybody to hold him down. And at the moment, probably not going to want to think about it. Fuck. Luckily, Jesse's, you know, not, not like a one-friend pony, so he's going to be fine. But his wife, uh, Total Biscuit's wife, she's just... Man, I hope she does come on the next podcast, the co-optional podcast. Because I want to hear that podcast, and I want to... Like she mentioned, you know, she could use it as a thing for mourning for her and the community. And <laughs> holy shit, dude, the world needs that. I think. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, let's move on. Uh, uh, yeah. Like, dude, that that news got me tearing. Like, I wasn't like <laughs> because I get like that sometimes about just worrying about my dog, but like laying in bed with tears running down my eyes because it's just so fucking sad, man. So yeah, do as he always said after he finally got diagnosed. If you got downstairs trouble, go to the damn doctor. Even if it's embarrassing, go to the damn doctor. And vote for politicians that are going to work towards a single-payer healthcare system. He didn't say that, I'm saying that, but vote for them because for the love of God... It is so stupid that in our country so many people will put off getting medical exams because of money. Or they'll botch their freaking medical stuff because they're completely out of it and suddenly they don't have it when they really need it. And Jesus Christ, it's a joke. That's me there. Vote for somebody who's going to go for a single-payer system that's actually going to take care of its citizens and not just say, hey, you forgot to pay this bill. Enjoy not having health insurance for two months and, uh, yeah, goodbye. Fuck you, box. Fuck. Okay, moving on. Let's... Because I'm going to get all political then. I'm talking about medical stuff. Because I feel like society failed Total Biscuit. Because it should have been like, like, dude's got cancer. It's pretty bad. Okay, well, here's all of these treatments we've been working on. Because we put all of our resources as a government, as a species, as a country towards ensuring our citizens survive. Even if they get dreadful fucking diseases. Fuck. Okay, I'm getting fucking angry now. Let's move on. Fuck. Give me a second, okay? Fuck. Fuck. I'll be back. I'll be right back. I need a drink. Like, water or milk, not alcohol. <laughs> Don't worry about that now. Be right back. Sure got rid of my fear of the cave, though, eh?
<sighs> All right, guys, I'm back. Um, yeah. Alrighty, uh, we're back. Spooky game, scary game, spooky game, scary game. That fire looks... What the hell kind of fire is that? This must be like one of their cinematic fires. Anyway, I have no idea where we came from. I think we came from over there. It was flat water. I mean, I was just not paying any attention. Um, yeah. Let's see. Can we make another boom boom? Yeah, in conclusion, Toll Biscuit's passing absolutely agonizing came home from work at like four in the morning and that was like the first thing i had saw when i turned my phone on the twitter is that he was gone absolutely agonizing man one of the greatest peeps out there really disappointed in society for letting him down but we can carry on and uh remember the great things he said and thought try to take them into account improve as people and as a society. <sighs> so where the hell are we now? <laughs> oh, Sage, you're in a dark, scary tunnel. Thanks, thanks, that's very useful. Do we have any sticks? I think we got sticks. That will at least help me get back. Hey, look, this looks familiar. I'll deal with that in a second. What about you? What do you have, friend? Ah, you have a frack ton of water. <gasps> Imagine that. Is this the one? Oh, this might be the one. Yeah, this is the one with the, uh... Oh, two tanks were in here. Yeah. Hmm. So we've come full circle. I think that's pretty much everything in this cave. You're cold and blah, 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 blah. I'm not going to put the other suit on because it'll just cause all of our good stuff to go flying. Hmm. <gasps> Are you fucking serious? That's how I die? Oh, good. Thank God. Okay. <sighs> well, we're done in that cave anyway. We're back over here now. And we've already finished this cave. Oh, I'm glad they grabbed us and dragged us back here. Job of those around. Was there a wall we could break here that would also get us a flashlight? No, I don't think so. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh, oh yeah, healing. That would be smart, wouldn't it? Yeah, no, if you die every now and again, it'll put you here. It's like a second chance thing. But if you die too soon after that, you did it. Why did I do that? I feel like a monster. I think it's because I'm... Ah, uh, something. Alright. This should give us some weapons. I mean, arrows. Or explosives. Oh, flares. That works. TNT. Drinks. And if we got drinks, we can drink some drinks. And eat some... Um... Who wants root beer, man? I want tons of root beer. Damn, do I never want to go back to work, work. Alright. Let's see. Skulls, useful. Thank you very much. 
Thank you, thank you. Okay, fire. We should have a save point right there, but we don't want that. Let's see. So we were way up there in the north when we just kicked the bucket there like freaking idiots. Um, we could heal, or we could just keep on walking and wait for our health to come back. we got tons of arms, so we should be fine. Uh, let's put the damn lighter away. There's no point in holding that out like a fool. What else do we got? So I'm guessing that map we looked at, the island... See, look, there's another plug over here. The island in question must be farther to the north than I thought. Like, northeast of the, uh, uh crater. The, uh, um, herb, herb, um, uh... Fuck off. Okay, dokey, okay. How many leaves do we got? A couple hundred... Yeah, good. How much of this do we got? Not quite as much as I'd like. We might head over the green area. Thank God you moved. I was going to be all depressed if I'd succeeded in that. Hello, Waterland. Alright, so let's see. What do we want to do? We got our to-do list. Pop that open here. And a waterfall fucking cave, which I thought that's where we just were, but apparently it wasn't. There's like two passageways that I don't remember where the hell we were when we were in them. Ah, I think one is just up here, so we'll go check that out. This is the one we came out and fought the where we were on top of the rock, right? We were like right here and we were fighting guys, or was it down there? Down there, was that right here? I think that was right here. If it was, there's probably a fire nearby. Hmm. Well, this time, let's not press E too early, huh? That's, that's how I fell off the rope, like an idiot. So I thought I saw the ground below me. I'm like, okay, there's the ground. Pressed E and then kept on falling. I tried to press E to get back on the rope, but uh, that didn't work so well. Is this it? This is a long way down. I'd love to turn on no clip at some point in this game and just look at the world from outside. Just to see what everything actually looks like. Man, we're lucky it didn't break all of our armor when we fell and they dragged us away. I got real lucky there, man, because it's been a long time since we saved. I think you blah 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 blah. And I think you guys might be right about maybe I should use a flashlight more. We did get some more batteries, so it's not like we're on the brink of running out. <gasps> it's another body. Okay, maybe we've not been maybe we've not been down here then. English sage. Maybe we've not been down here. It was so good. Yeah, at the very end, you can just... Yeah. Huh. Huh! Huh! <laughs> huh, this looks familiar. So why is this one not... Oh, it's not Blink it's just a Molly. So earlier when we were like, I think we've already been down that way. It's literally right here. Got ya. Alright, we'll go back up to the surface world then. Splish splash, I'm taking a bath. Look at that climb. Jesus. Oh, Christ, that's adorable. God, I love it when dogs do that. Little dreams, puppy dreams. I don't notice Lad doing that too much anymore. In the past, I, I remember him doing stuff. Oh, and sometimes, oh God, it was so funny when he was younger and he was like a little pupper. Um, he'd be laying down, and I, I loved laying down and snuggling with him. So I'd lay down face to face, so his snout would be like that with me, and I'd be holding his paws, his two front paws, and I'd doing that with him, and he'd be going. Just the cutest little puppy twitches while I'm holding his paws and be like, oh, <laughs> oh god. <sighs> oh, 
oh, I just want to go snuggle with him right now. <laughs> but it's like, oh, if I go snuggle with him right now, I'm going to spend 10, 20 minutes there, and then I'm going to get up and want to come back and keep streaming. And I don't want people to have to walk away from the stream and come back. Oh. <laughs> I wish he would snuggle with me in here more, but I don't think he likes the heat and the noise. Since, you know, I got the big old computer running and my big self heating up the room. Let's save. Alright. Now let's go back down this one. I think there was one more path we've forgotten here. If I could get back into the borehole thing, but uh yeah. Were we climbing out of here when we died? And was it this rope or another one? Also, I need to go get some, like, Sprite or something, or else I'm going to drink a whole gallon of milk in this evening. Oh, thanks, man. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, we're down here again. Howdy ho, friends. I'm pretty sure we went this way, right? Here, we can pop up a map. So yeah, I'm pretty sure we went this way. Uh, look at that. Look at the map. The wet cave or whatever. To the far east. We've not fully explored that. And I think it's this way. Not in the mood to be scared. So if you're going to spook me, spook me. I'll scream like the little girl and then we can fight and be over it. So yeah, I think this is it. And we just Were we going down here when we died? Also, can I open the map while climbing? That would be hilarious. It's like, I'll just climb with uh, no arms. Just use my legs and hold the map. Ah, that's it. Did you see that? Look to the left. There looks like a ledge there. So I, th I think this is the rope we fell off of. I thought that was the ground right there, and I just let go. <gasps> Fuck. Game. Startled me. I remember there was a cave we were in once where it had like a waterfall like this and there was like a path with good two paths and we took one and never went back to the other one. Uh, I don't, hey, good news guys, I'm getting scared again. I think this is the area where we put the other fire over here, right? The big one? Is this it? Maybe not. Alright, let's open the map. Where are we? Where are we going? We are going east. That's where we gotta go. Let's get that flashlight out, huh? <clears throat> Actually, no, let's do that uh, thing you guys were talking about. The... Can I put a cloth on this and burn it? <gasps> Pain! <clears throat> okay. No, I can't. I could do it with my axe. Can I do it with this axe? Surely the whole thing would burn, right? I mean, it's wood. Screw it. The only reason I stopped doing this previously... Oh, there's the other fire I was thinking of. Is because it's like two swings and the axe craps out. Also, yeah, look at this. Oh, and also if you put it away, it craps out. So yeah, this is like the big... KVK room, there's stuff to the east we never finished exploring, it looks like. So I keep on going to the east. Sam saying, Opa! 
That's fucking creepy shit. Also, why can I not make more explosives? Really? We have maximum explosives? It's hard to believe that. Alright, so map again puts out the damn torch. So annoying. Is this the rope we fell off of, maybe? Don't even know anymore. No, this is the way that led out, right? It was another exit? Or was it? You know, I'm pretty sure this leads to where the water thing was. It's just so hard to keep track of this damn place. Yeah, this is where it forks and it leads out. Yeah. But you know what? Let's actually go out here. Can I tie this around it and light that up? No? That would be really useful, actually. Hey, scary fucking caves. How you doing? It's good. That's well, good to hear. I'm just running around here, seeing if there's anything I missed, like, apparently, the robot leg. Another fire. Oh, right, because there's water right here, and I kept falling in it. Sploosh. Dead bodies. Oh, right, this is like that tunnel way that leads nowhere, right? Climbing a star way to heaven. It's so fucking weird, this. It's like, do you feel like there should be something here, but there ain't nothing? We poked around this pretty thoroughly last time, so I'm not gonna keep poking. I don't wanna be in this creepy water suit too long. Suit too long. Suit too long line. Maybe this is why the map's not complete, because it's uh, underwatery bits. So the game just like, pfft, you don't have to get to full map. It's cool. Underwater stuff is so damn scary. Alright, let's warm up. Unequip that. Equip our good torch again. Swoosh. Can't carry any more uh, watches. Nothing up here. Some meds, which, you know what, since our health is pretty shit. Uh, om nom. Looks like this is the way out. Ah! <sighs> you know, I'm starting to think maybe that bat thing? Kind of fucking lame. Just maybe a bit. Alright, so we explored that. Save the game. Uh, did we? Nothing? No. Okay, cool. I'll just freaking starve because I haven't been hunting because I don't want to hunt. Alright, so there's that. Let's go up to the island in the watery area to the northwest of here. If that is an island. And let's see if we can get ourselves the cockpit which is apparently up here according to that one map we saw online for like 20 seconds oh hello are you something to eat no you're a tiny rock now find clean water to drink well guess what world drink it find berries to drink these are the bad ones right They're the bad ones. Hold on. 
Can I collect these even though they're the bad ones? I can. Snow, what's it collected? Huh. Hey, birds, can I just collect your feathers? Please? Please? No? Fine. Twin berries collected. I thought it said twinker berries, like Twinker Bell or like Twinkies. Hmm. More tents up here. I don't remember finding these. Eh. Actually, this time I think I'll just build a quick shelter. It takes rocks. The other one just takes tree. Now oh, whatever. Fuck it all. Oh fuck. Out of fuel. Oh, cool. oh sci-fi desk. Well, I know how to get there. It's a cave, like, sort of northwest of the island will take me there. Or I think there's one I can swim down into. But I'd rather just build a walkway down into it so we don't have to go through that nightmare again. Because I went through it once um, in reverse, <laughs> and it was pretty horrifying. I mean, it'd be better now I cleared it all out, but it seems like it'll take three months. So I get the feeling we might end up wanting to go up and down, up and down a few times. It's like, we'll get down there, we'll go, okay, we've done enough in the spooky land of Spookerton. Time to go to back to the surface. And if we have to go all the way through it again, it's going to be a pain in the arse. Also, it means that if uh, we end up getting our arse kicked and it's time to retreat, it'll be easier. Giving the caves numbers doesn't help at all if they're not numbered on the damn map. Cave 7, which is where? Which is fucking where? Is it clockwise or counterclockwise from where you spawn? Is it... I don't fucking know. Also, we still have no food, but hopefully we'll find some chocolate bars. Also, I really want more milk. Oh. Hello? <laughs> Is anybody home? I think we've been here before. Like, I'm 30% sure this is the cave where we got the climbing tool from. And, like, this is the way we climbed out. But it wasn't on our map, was it? I'm pretty sure this is it, though. Like, this seems like it. Man, my character looks like a fucking monster. <laughs> what? I feel like... What the hell is going on? Why can't I... Am I on the ground? I'm on the ground. And immediately a skull. Well, maybe this isn't the place I thought it was. Let's just set up a light. To be sure. I think this is it, but... I don't know, man. Some of this doesn't seem quite as familiar as I thought it would. Oh, I thought I saw some crawling out. It's just that light over there. 
Okay, now this doesn't seem familiar. This doesn't seem familiar. I don't like this. Fuck, I don't like this at all. What's fucking, fucking dark, man? Hello? Uh, any vile evil monsters about care to fight me? I'd much prefer you uh, show yourselves from afar and not wait until you're two feet in front of me. Oh, fuck, I know. Fuck this shit. I know, there's a light spot, like, naturally right here, but if nothing else, this at least lets me know I was here. I think I've been here, though, but... Where's the map, huh? We can pull up a map. So maybe we have? I don't know. This stupid cave system is so confusing. I think we've been through here, though. Yeah, this is it. This is where you get the climbing tools. Okay. Okay. Woo. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, what? Vile and a monster, but not evil. Well, if you're vile, what that... It depends on the kind of vile, like... You vile fiend, or you just... Vile isn't physically... Vile. Can you only be physically vile? Anyway. Meh. I don't know. So you're saying I'll feel bad for spending like two streams on trying to complete a uh, stairway down into the pit? Skull crusher. <laughs> uh, Alright. I think we've explored most of the caves. There's a waterfall cave somewhere. I can't bloody find it. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Oh, we can just do it in-game. What am I doing? What have I done? What have I done? Stop it. Um, web browser. That took like three months to find the button. Mainly because I couldn't remember what I was looking for. Uh, the Forest Waterfall Cave Entrance. Since somebody else is already searching for it. Oh good, the same bloody map. Hey, mommy, how you doing? Oh, hey look, this does have numbers on it. And it doesn't have a... Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, chasm, sinkhole... One dead cave, waterfall cave. Waterfall cave is ten. Where the hell is ten? Ten is not on the... Fucking map. Six six six. Da da da. Five five five. Two one 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 four two. One nine seven nine three four nine eight seven six five four seven nine. What? Waterfall cave. What the shit? There it is, 10, right there in that camp. Huh? I could have sworn I'd been in there. It's funny, number 9, that's where we just were, I think. Alright, let's go to that cockpit thing. That's apparently over here, it's way south of where we are. Alright, well we found it. I don't know how we missed it, considering it says it's like in that camp, and we've been in that camp about 70 million times. It's right next to the bulwark. But fuck it. That's where we're going now, eh? As soon as we get the cockpit. So. 
cockpit is apparently south of us. Maybe it's in this puddle? Like, that map is so freaking different than this. Look at that map. It's like, you got a big watery land there. And it's like, no. No, there's lots of ground here. Is this from the beta or something? And you got a lovely little island at the fork. What? There is a little island at the fork, but Jesus Christ, it's hardly the same. Yeah. It's that little island. That's the island. You tell me the fucking cockpit's on this island? Listen. Unless there's literally a pit full of chickens, I don't think it's on this island. In fact, I'm 100% sure it's not on this fucking little island, you lying sack of shit map. Version 0 0.54, it's ancient. Frack you, map. Frack you. Funny thing is... Okay, we'll check that one then. It was on an island. Uh, website uses cookies like every fucking website on earth. Oh, you declined it, so we're not going to work at all. <laughs> Alright. Jesus Christ, this map is... Whoa, hey, brother, ain't that a fucking map, huh? Oh, man, that's a map, alright. Oh, shit. Oh, fucking hell. Bloody hell, that's a map. Oh, hey, it's got all, like, the gun position. Let me pull this on screen so people can see it. That is a map. That is a freaking map. Oh, now the cockpit's been moved way up there. All right, so it's no longer down here on the fucking island. Uh, huh. All right. Well. Oh, all righty then. Should we get the gun before we go farther, huh? Just head to all these little gun part places? I think that's what that means, right? Cash one. I think that's what these are. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Sure is something, ain't it? Wow. Oh my god, there really is a cave entrance. We're going to the waterfall cave. I don't know how the hell we missed that. We've been there like 40 fucking times. Oh, also, uh, control A, control C, alt F4, alt enter. Shift 12, no, Shift Tab, Web Browser, Control T, nope, doesn't work. Click the thing, type the buttons, Control V at all after doing a Control A on it all, and away we go to the Land of Magical Ponies, and boom, accept the track my whatever, I don't care, we got it in game now. Cool. <laughs> so hurt. Alright, so let's see, we need to go... Also, what I've learned from looking at that is this little map is just bullshit. No wonder I can't find shit on it. The thing is not equally spaced. Don't do it. You did it. You attacked first. Was that kind of dark? It seemed a bit dark. Seriously, here another one? What are you freaking. Where are you coming from? Jesus Christ on a bag. Where are you all coming from? You coming from the mountain? You probably shouldn't be coming down here. It's a bit dangerous this time of year for little wiver snappers like you. Uh, shift to 12. Oh, fuck, they're still running. <laughs> uh, so we should be. We're near one of these camp things here over here, you see. Well, this map is a little bit hard to read sometimes. Uh, let's see. Can I force stop this? Because that might lag me. I don't like that one bit. What was that? 
What's that fucking thing mean? What's that thing mean? What's that thing mean? What's that thing mean? Mean, mean. So let's go for that lake. Which I think is the one south west of here. Which is that way. Oh, uh, there's a lot more than I thought there were, so let's just pretend I'm not here. That's great. Good. Now that you've all forgotten I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and kill you all. Now hold still, and this will hurt only horribly. <gasps> oh, fuck. Better run, or I'll turn you into my boots. You don't want to be boots for a man like me. My feet sweat terribly. Don't want to be boots, boy. Don't want to be boots. Oh, fuck, I need sticks. Quickly, give me some sticks. That's not sticks. Your sticks. What are you doing? You want to be sticks? Join the stick club. Birdie, watch out. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Where you at? You think your shit don't smell? I can smell you from 20 miles away. Oh, fuck. What the fuck was that? Come here. Now hold still. Very important you don't move. I want your freaking weapon. I want your freaking bones. I need your bones. When you're America's best value. Fucking fuck was that? Oh From God! America's best value is invading. In my dreams, I don't have to worry so much about my child anymore. Get thirty percent off paints and stains. Oh, 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 Fucking ads loaded on that website. You know, <laughs> that was horrible. That map website, shh, it's staying quiet. Fuck that website. I'm not opening that goddamn website up again. Mm -mm. Hell no. <laughs> I'll open it up on another tab or I can mute it. Or I can say, hey, Chrome, mute the fuck out of this tab. This tab, mute the fuck out of it. It was like 13 adverts started all at once. Horrible. Absolutely horrible. I'll close it. You know what? Yeah, I'll close it completely. I'll just open it up every time I need it. Which is going to be constantly. Let's make ourselves some more bone armor. Shit. I always do that. Why is this blinking? Yes, there's berries here. Stop blinking. So stupid when I hold that. I hold anything else. Robot's done. Timmy's toy. And apparently I can make Timmy's toy too? I don't get it. Like I put it there and it's like, hey, you're halfway to crafting Timmy's toy times two. Can I have been gathering all the parts again? Are you telling me I should have been crafting it? Oh, for God's sake, if you were telling me. I should have been crafting it as I go. I'm going to be a little bit annoyed. <sighs> Alright. Stop looking at your hand. It's a hand. Also, you. Crack you. What are you doing running at me? This island is mine now, don't you understand? I built a bridge. I also built a walkway. You know what else I built? Stuff. I also covered your breasts in blood. That way we don't get taken down. Do you not understand the positive things I'm doing for this community? I'm doing great things for this community. What are you doing? Flailing half-naked beast people without reproductive organs. 
You are cloned meat from hell, and I must send you back to it and purge this island of your undead beastliness. You, you vile beast, stop crawling backwards like a worm! Be a man, not a worm! Be a man! Yes, oh yes, be defeated, be defeated, be defeated, don't you dare run away. All this combat and you run, I will be very angry. Don't you squirrel away from me. Yes, hit me, hit me. Be like a man, not like a pudding pie. Be defeated now, be defeated. Why are you standing back up? I thought I defeated you. Did I not defeat you? It was somebody else I defeated, wasn't it? No, you don't fucking run from me. Don't you freaking dare run from me. Get back here, you freaking bastard.